Hey, it's JC1424 once again with NASCAR Legends! And in this episode of our 70s season, as David Pearson, the Silver Fox, we're going to be completing race 10 of 27, which is the World 600 at Charlotte Motor Speedway. The only 600 you get in NASCAR. You know, it wouldn't be Coca-Cola because they weren't that popular back in the 70s. If anything, it would have been Pepsi. So last episode, we raced at Darlington. I could have won that, gone back-to-back -back with my win at North Wilkesboro. But I was very tired, and I also kind of got wrecked into the wall at a restart by Ty Lee Lund when I was leading after being tired. And I should, you know, not record races whenever I'm tired. Am I tired right now? That is top secret information. I will not be disclosing that. <laughs> ah, weren't these the days whenever a D oval like this was unique? Such a beautiful track. You can't wait till we get to see the, the fans in the grandstands. Gonna give us two laps. And I'm already up to speed for the first one, so we got two chances to really make this work. Yeah, I'm the second guy out in qualifying. The first one is Pete Hamilton, the 40 car with a 36-3. So if I do better than the 36-3, I don't know what the hell that means because there's not a bunch of guys that really came out. Usually, if half the field's qualified and I come out, then I can roughly say that the guy that's already on pull is probably gonna stay there, if not be up front. Oh, we're getting tight in the front stretch. Oh, I got a 35-0. It's good enough for me. Pete Hamilton's pretty good, right? Destruction! Only guy right now who's uh, come close to me is Bobby Isaac with a 35-6. So if someone beats Bobby Isaac, I don't think they're going to do that much better than a 35-6. Uh, well, I mean, Kale Yarrow's gotten in there. Yep, another poll. It's too easy, the qualifying in this freaking game. I mean, I'm not even using a setup yet, but I'm going to put that on once we get into this race. Okay, get ready. Green. Typical Bobby Isaac, always starting up front. Let's just stay side by side with him. We'll be all good. We going? Green flag, green flag. Yep, here we go. And he beats me to the line. And he gets away. No penalty for that. AI don't get penalty. You know, if I did that, and, and I was starting in like second that they would black flag me for it so world 600 100 laps getting that run off of turn two already see how the tires wear down as we go through this one i think the pavement might be relatively old because this was one of like the original tracks in nascar which is why it was unique at the time and now it is not at all so like home track of nascar not daytona which daytona was in this game Okay, well, that was not smart at all. I should have not done that, and I did that. Back in is all yeah, no shit, because I'm stupid. I had nothing to do with that. It's like Back half a lap the after they announced the damage to my car. They're, they're still wrecking on the front street, apparently. So I'm racing back to the line, and then it'll slow down the pace speed. Okay, where's the tire marks? There are the tire marks. And here I come, not passing the pace car. Okay, would you? Okay, fine. Like, are you gonna let me enter my pit stall, or are you gonna just get in the way? Oh, that's that's the flag guy. My pit stall's all the way over there. Oh my goodness, I am so fucking dumb. That's the dumbest. That's the second dumbest thing I've done yet, or maybe it's the, the first. I don't know. Okay, so, they're giving me my pit stop, good shit. Go, go. What? I get special privilege, my pit stop. Y'all don't take pit stops until I'm done with mine. Okay, now y'all can have y'all's pit stops. Oh, that's... I, I probably would've lost some positions on pit road fixing that damage. I'm getting to him. Yeah, that, the 106 car. Oh, okay, past the 06 car. I'm doing that. What the hell's going on? Yep, and um, I'm second. Four cars a leader. Pink car up top. Um, 
Why are all these guys in front of us? I didn't lap any cars. I... No. What the hell? So, how do they wind up a lap down? How does that happen? The 70s are stupid. Because, like, I'm second. And all these lap cars are here. The four car is the leader, and then I've never lapped any cars. No one... I don't know. Did the pace car decide to put some guys lap down? I don't get this game. Ugh, poor Kill Yarrow trapped a lap down. Richard Petty's trapped a lap down. I don't remember who drives a four car, I never can remember. But, making some moves up top right now. Slicing down to the inside. And we're checking up for the 21. Damn, you guys are slow. I didn't feel like I was that much faster than the guys behind me throughout that first run, but I'm checking up big time for these guys in front of me. Uh, the guy's trying to go to the outside. I'm just trying to find a, a place to go. If I go up top, I'm going to scrub off speed. If I go to the inside, I'm going to crash into some guys. So I have to wait for a hole to open up. I'm not exactly that concerned because the only guy that need to pass to take the lead is this four car right here. Driving into the grass, and just like that, it's ours. I did the pass in the grass, and I did it at Charlotte. And I'm David Pearson. Fuck Earnhardt, fuck Elliot. David Pearson. <laughs> okay. No, no, Richard Petty, get your ass over here. You're going down a lap two, sissy. Richard Petty, the king. Man, you're not even Quinn. More like Richard Petty, the bitch. Now fucking son of a bitch. I have no more tires on this car. Don't tell me what I know. God damn it, he can't even turn the fucking straightaway. Uh, I'm gonna pit this time because he said my tires were getting worn a while ago, which means I'm probably about to start popping shit. Yeah, I'm keeping low. I wish I could get to lapping this guy and all that good stuff, but I'm gonna pull off the track, not get nailed. Okay, so let's head in there. Do, 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 do. Slow it down. Uh, there we go. Now, stop is starting. That's a weird phrase. The stop is starting. Is the start stopping? You know, I'm second. Gone around. And all the other guys gonna go all the way around just to get back to me. Okay, so we're fourth. A couple other guys that are back behind it. So I think it's like three guys were on the lead lap. That's how it's looking right now. Four guys. I mean, aside from me, of course. I, mean, I could never not be on the lead lap. Okay, the car behind me. I'm trying to stay off the track. Can't turn down here. Okay, let, let's get up to speed. Not in, not in the way. This should be getting us back into seventh or sixth. I passed a car and gained two positions from it. Oh, I'm such a beast. Now ah, there's people starting to take their pit stops now. A few laps after mine. I mean, some people are pitting after me under the caution and they could probably make their tires last longer. I don't know how long I had to go until my tires are blowing. Up to fifth. And the 22 car is all the way over there. I don't know what you're talking about, jackass. We've caught the 22 car. I guess we're trying to make this pass on the outside. Yeah, we'll get a runoff turn four right here. He lets me. Thank God. And this is for second. And now I'm in the lead. Got cars taking pit stops, and I'm taking it that uh, Bobby Allison going to be like the last guy. Points leader Richard Petty is just having the worst race because you know he's falling two laps down right now. We already lapped him and there's no way that he gained all that back and now I'm putting him back a lap down. No, he's two laps down. Lapping some more cars. It's the same song and dance every single week. Why do I even care? It's so fucking dumb! Why? 
fucking why, man? You've got to be kidding me. Why me? I just can't have a bunch of good races. Might as well climb out of that car. We're done. Yeah, I know! Fuck me! I'm 20th. I'm gonna finish last. Watching these uh, race stats play out because this is the only way that really makes sense. Richard Petty's winning. Bobby Allison's winning. Bobby Allison wins. Okay. I was supposed to go from 11th to 8th at least. Instead, I went from 11th to 13th. You know, it could be worse than that. I could have fallen to 14th, 15th, 16th. I've just been having so many bad races, but I mean, I guess they can be a bit random sometimes. The AI. I mean, John Sears was having a good race. He's in last right now, so that's good for him, but he's not getting anywhere. Uh, Richard Petty was supposed to lose the points lead. and said he increased his points lead. I fucking hate this shit. Well, let's, let's just get this recording of this video out of the way so I can move on to recording Martinsville. So Virginia 500, 125 laps. And it's 500 because it'd be 500 laps at full length. So it's a much shorter race, so short that I should not have the opportunity to blow my engine. I don't know if me popping the wall had anything to do with that. Because I've hit the wall a bunch of times and that didn't happen. So why did it happen this time? Because they just spontaneously decide that I should blow up. When other cars blow up, they get it fixed, they head back on track. But me? No. I regret turning this shit on. Because it's bad enough that I suck at this game. Ugh. Oh. I really wish I had won Darlington and not been a stupid sleepyhead because uh, th this wouldn't be so bad. I'll probably still be 11th at, at, at worst. See you next time. That's that and episode over.